It's 12 and 13 career regular season games against the Lakers. He has a losing record against only two other teams in the league, Utah and Houston, but he averages almost 30 points a game against these Lakers in his career. The L.A. Lakers are 41 and 30. They are 25 and 10 here in Staples Center, 16 and 20 on the road. They'll start Kobe Bryant and Derek Fisher in the back in the backcourt. Kobe's averages have skyrocketed in this is sixth season to 30 points per game and seven rebounds. And up front, a change made last minute. Mark Madsen for Robert Ory with Shaquille O'Neal and Rick Fox. You see Shaq's numbers in 23 career games against Washington, averaging 28 and a half points on 56% field goal shooting and 14 rebounds. The head coach in his fourth season here in L.A. is Phil Jackson, 222 wins, 95 losses. Amazingly, he's been the head coach of nine of the last 12 NBA champions, six in Chicago and the last three in L.A. Wizards won the first game, November 8th, 199 at MCI Center. Last year, L.A. swept a pair, winning by nine here and by 20 in Washington. And the Lakers have won nine straight games at home. The last Wizards victory here, February 14th, 1992. Washington comes off two very impressive victories on the road in Portland and Seattle. MJ's first jumper, got it. It's interesting you have Rick Fox actually guarding Jordan, but throughout the course of the game, I'm sure you'll see that matchup come through with Jordan uh, going against Kobe. Have come at San Antonio and at Sacramento. Stackhouse drives, finds Jordan again. MJ's second jumper got another one. How pumped up do you think he is to play here tonight? I tell you, it's, uh, it's going to be fun to watch this whole game. Wizards lead four to nothing. Steve Buckhans and Phil Chenier on Copcast Sportsnet tonight. Kobe's first jumper, that's good. Kobe Bryant averaging 30.1 points a game. He's second in the NBA. He also averages seven rebounds and almost six assists, which is 13th, and 2.2 steals, which is fifth. How about that stretch of nine consecutive 40-plus games? Jordan, one-on-one -on -one against Fisher. Fade away by MJ. How do you like yes. that? He's three for three. MJ around Fox, fadeaway jumper, unbelievable! Jordan is four for four. The Wizards are five for five, shooting 100% for the quarter. Madsen to go to Fox, around Jordan. Now Kobe from long range, oh my. That's his 97th three-pointer of the season. He shoots 37% from out there. Don't get the call. I think that was a good block. Shaq got there quick enough. Kobe, elbow, jumper, and he's fouled. Kobe Bryant and Teron Lou speaking with each other. Of course, Lou, a couple of years ago, getting a championship ring here in Los Angeles and was noted for his defensive play against Allen Iverson in the playoffs. And Kobe clearly having his best season of an already outstanding career. Yeah. His points are up, but uh, what impresses me is his rebounds. He's uh, averaging seven rebounds a game. He's uh, 13th in the league in assists. He's fourth in the league in steals. I mean, no part of his game is, is dropping off because of his score. Jordan with a steal. Well, he has really been alert defensively. Especially tonight in this early going, looking for opportunities to double team, looking for opportunities like that last one to pick off the pass. Stackhouse, that's knocked away and stolen. That's the second turnover by Jerry this quarter. Boy, he missed a golden opportunity. Laker was open in the corner. Post up ability of Shaquille. Long jumper, three-pointer, Kobe Bryant. He is unbelievable. That's 98 on the year. He's got two in the game. Jordan off a screen. Missed that one.
Boy, these players are working so hard to get open off these screens. Wizards lead down to four. Kobe's fadeaway good. 14 points for Kobe Bryant, and they've cut the Wizards' lead from eight to two. Teron Liu, 0 for 3 tonight. Nice spin move from Kobe, able to get to the baseline and once again showing that strength. Kobe for three. Unbelievable. With four ten seconds left in the quarter. Oh! Would it have counted? I believe it would have. What a quarter it was. The Wizards started out making their first seven field goals, and then Kobe got hot. He's made seven of nine, including a couple of three-pointers. He has 19 points to lead all scores. Jordan is five of eight. He's got 13 points. Wizards built an eight-point lead. It's down to one. After one in L.A., Washington 28, the Lakers 27. In the first quarter, Kobe brought him back, the Lakers, that is. They trail now by one. Here's his jumper, and that's the first lead of the night for Los Angeles. Kobe Bryant, 8 of 10, has 21 points, and he is not missing by Bobby Simmons, and now it's regained by Samaki Walker. Here's Kobe again. Okay, Jerry Stackhouse is going to have to step up and get a hand for us. Kobe to do something else. 11 to shoot. Long five seconds. <laughs> At the... Unbelievable. Another three for Kobe. His fifth in one plus quarters. In Orlando. And now it's held by Kobe Bryant. And he's got five of them here already tonight, making six. You know, he's one of those players, and I don't want to say like Jordan, but he's one of those players that really starts to feel himself getting into that rhythm. His emotions get picked up. And he just doesn't believe anyone can stop him. And he's getting close to that zone. Bryant has missed just two shots in 13 attempts, and he's got 30 points in the game. 30 or more points, now make it 38. Of course, uh, among those are two 50-point games that he's had, but... You know, when I heard you say going to break 30 points, I really thought you made a mistake. <laughs> you don't trust your partner, do you? Those points in the first half this season is 36. That was uh, in Denver. Just before the All-Star break. Kobe had his career high last year of 56 points. In fact, when Jordan had 51 last year against Charlotte, it was the fourth highest scoring game of the season in the NBA. Iverson had 58 once, Kobe had 56, and Tim Duncan had 53. This season, Kobe's season high may fall. It's 52 points against Houston on February 18th here at Staples Center. 17 points. And he's fouled, Kobe, by Brian Russell. Got Brian Russell up in the air and through the contact. Looking to be super aggressive in terms of his offense. And that time got Brian Russell off his feet and drew the foul. Kobe makes the free throw. That high trajectory draws nothing but the twine. He's shooting so far out in front of him. Kobe again. Oh, my! Three-pointer number seven for Kobe Bryant. And Phil, what kind of zone is he in? <laughs> A zone I've never seen or heard of. I mean, it's amazing. He's just coming down, spotting up behind the three, pulling up. 
Rod Serling hasn't seen that kind of zone. 5.42 to go in the first half, and Kobe Bryant has been spectacular with 35 points, and the Lakers lead by six. And Devin was able to sneak up behind him. To Heidi back playing Shaquille with two fouls on him. Standing in that lane. Kobe guarded by Lou. Kobe's long jumper. Oh, no! He is burning down the house! Eight three-pointers for Kobe Bryant, and he's got 38 points. Is he going to pull up from three? <laughs> oh, come on. Somebody stop him. How many choices do you have now? 40 points for Kobe Bryant with 4.36 to play in the first half. He is unbelievable. Standing O. Is he the heir apparent? He certainly looks like it tonight. else. <laughs> He is amazing. Timeout in L.A. By Kobe Bryant, who is 14 of 16 from the field. He has eight three-pointers on eight of nine shooting. He's made all four of his free throws, and he's got 40 points with 436 to he's play in the He's not to be denied, and you can see how tight Teron Lue was on trying to force him to put the ball on the floor. He looked that off and still pulled up for the three. And it's only because of Kobe Bryant that the Lakers have surged to an 11-point lead. Fans urging Kobe. They want him to shoot. Runs over Jordan, and it's an offensive foul. Uh, you know, you can't help but get caught up in Kobe watching, whether you're on his team or on the opposing team. I mean, this, what we've seen is just unbelievable. I mean, this guy has been shooting threes like they're layups. Guys hanging over him, challenging the shot. Lakers can take the final shot. The shot clock is off. The fans want Kobe to shoot it. I'm sure they do. They'd love to see him shoot a three. Let's see if Stackhouse takes that away from him. And he fouls him. Foul to give. First personal on Stackhouse. And it was. It is a penalty situation. <laughs> That's how effective this guy is. He makes you change your, your train of thought as opposed to allowing him to even raise up and shoot that three, send him to the free throw line. Almost like an intentional walk. This guy hook. Wizards can bring it up. Five seconds to play. Double team on Lou. He needs help for Leighton. Christian's jumper. Doesn't get this one. Kobe Bryant, nothing short of spectacular. 42 points in the half on 14 of 19 shooting, which includes eight of 11 three-pointers and all six of his free throws. Bryant on fire. He and the Lakers are leading the Wizards 59-48 at the half.